Next, we have a young actress, also from Twin Peaks Middle School, Miss Anna Kaplan, and she's going to share her feelings about being the image of per perfection, or trying to be, which is hard at any age. She's going to share a monologue with us called Wonder Bread and Braces. Hmm. Enjoy Anna Kaplan. today, I began a new life, a life of captivity and a life of torture. I got braces. Four years later, and they're still attached to my teeth, just waiting for another opportunity to ruin my life. <laughs> wax. Let's discuss wax. It comes from bees. It comes from your ears. And you make candles with it. You don't stick it in your teeth. What were orthodontists thinking anyway? And rubber bands? Let's talk about rubber bands, shall we? Last I checked, rubber bands were for holding newspapers together, not my teeth. But you know, I can deal with wax, rubber bands, and even headgear. But nothing, nothing compares to my biggest enemy, Wonder Bread sandwiches. <laughs> Have you ever noticed that when you eat a Wonder Bread sandwich, it gets, well, sticky? Add in metal braces, and you raise the sticky factor to the 20th power. So, for example, you're eating your Wonder Bread sandwich at lunch, when you realize you've got a Wonder Bread sandwich particle stuck between your braces. So, you immediately go to plan A, the tongue method. So, you're feeling around, trying to get that sucker out with your tongue. Inconspicuously, of course. But that's not working. So you go to plan B. The suction method. Everyone knows that when you close your mouth and suck in, you create a makeshift vacuum. So, if a vacuum works on carpet, why not your mouth? Naturally. So you begin the suction process. But that's not working either. So, you go to plan C, the finger method. By this time, you've passed inconspicuousness and moved right on ahead to looking like a bit of a nerd. But as hard as you try, you can't get your pinky through those two little brackets. So, as you're trying to figure out what your best plan of action will be, that cute boy walks by, you know, the one, and he's looking in your direction. But that doesn't matter. He's looking at the whole half of the lunchroom. Your heart's pounding fast, your hair's looking frizzy again, and you just don't know what to say, and you just want to scream. Okay, calm down. Oh no, what have you done wrong? Is it obvious that you adore the ground he even looks at, let alone walks on? And then it hits you. You're still holding the one of that sandwich particle on the toothpick, and you just want to die. <laughs> yeah, that's what I said. You know, there's a conspiracy against the youth of America. One by one, the Wonder Bread Sandwich Company is crushing the dreams of teenagers everywhere. My dad says braces will all be worth it when my teeth are straight and perfect. But who wants to be perfect anyway? Yeah, me too. <laughs>